Lindsay, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me video with a little bit of a twist. I'm going to have my husband be doing the voiceover for this video. Now he knows pretty much next to nothing about makeup so hopefully it's funny for you to watch. I've seen quite a few of these videos going around YouTube so I decided to rope my husband into doing one of these too. So without any further ado, let's wish my husband luck and hop right in. Okay, so this is your get ready video. I have absolutely no idea what's going on. Oh, it's okay. It's always good to wash your face. Uh huh. Get, get some of that tree trimmer stuff that I just saw in the last thing. Okay. It says hourglass. Very happy. I learned how to read. Uh, okay, you're setting a foundation. Uh huh. It's. I'm, I'm assuming this is a foundation. This is. You're preparing to go to war. I'm. Okay, oh, you're blending it in. Oh, that's very smooth, very, you yeah, getting it all in there, making sure you're going. Seems to be going very fast. I'm assuming this is sped up because you don't move this fast. So, all right, let's, let's see here. What is this? Oh, what do we got here? It's called a race paste and another word I can't read. Benefit. It says benefit. I saw that. It said benefit. All right, that's oh, okay. That's to get rid of the crow's feet. That's a word I know. It's a term I know. I'm very happy about that. Uh huh. Oh, born this way, the Lady Gaga collection. So let's let's see. Okay, this is to enhance the crow's feet, I guess. Um, again, preparing for war. I'm not really sure. Or your cult is having some sort of. Oh, you laughed at that. Okay, I'm happy. All right. Uh. You can blot it down with your giant egg that I've seen around the house. Yeah, um, that's just to sort of mesh, mash it all in together and, you know, make sure that it's all even and uh, even keel so that, you know, the layers of makeup on your skin just sort of pop at you. And... NARS! It's called NARS! <laughs> that's awesome, NARS. <laughs> I love that name. Okay, so now you're just uh, applying it to the other foundation stuff that you put on there. This is, I feel like I'm just preparing the Westworld crew. Okay, I can't read that, so I have no idea what that is. Oh, you got, you got a big brush going. Big brush, gotta get everything. Get the neck, get the neck. Uh-huh. Get the nose, you gotta get under there. That's from Kevin Augusten. And it's two colors, two colors. That's right, two different shades of tan. As if there are many shades of tan. And then we're gonna put that on on the cheekbones and uh, down the ear line, I guess, is what you call it. I'm not 100% positive on that. Gotta accent the features, is something I've heard people say. So um, that's what I'm going with there. Oh, that brush is green. I like that brush. Can we just focus on that brush? Is there any way to zoom in on that brush? No, all right. We'll just Keep it going. It looks like you're just picking your ear. <sighs> well, you got it. Oh, nope. Going back. No. All right. It looks like you got it. All right. Now you got to go up to the hairline. Going to make sure that you get every inch of your face with the makeup. You got to test everything. You got to make sure it's perfect. Got to make sure everything works out just perfectly. Can we focus on that green brush? That's just cool looking. I think that's very cool. You gotta make sure you get every single part of it. You're getting all, you're getting your money's worth out of this thing that I couldn't read. Or no, this was this was the Kevin Augen stuff. Yeah, that I had no idea what it is. I assume it's more foundation and putting something under the lip there. I, I, I don't know what you said. I don't know what is happening here. I can't read that. Clinique. It says Clinique, I've heard of that. You're marking yourself. And then you're putting it on your on the brush there, and oh, you're gonna accent the cheeks. You're gonna you're gonna bring out the cheekbones. You're gonna you're gonna puff it up and Oh, that's Laura Mercier. And that is a bronzer. That's a bronzer. I'm gonna say bronzer. I'm probably wrong. But it looked bronze. So I'm gonna say bronzer, you know, it's it's like in the Olympics, it's bronze. So that's that's where I'm going for that. Gotta get it on the neck, get it all over. All over, every, everything there. Oh, Kevin Algen again. Oh, we're back to Kevin. My wife has a crush on Kevin. All right, 
right, now you gotta get under the eyes again. We're gonna make sure that that other color meshes with the first one that Kevin. And the tip of the nose. All right, right on the forehead, down to the chin. I'm pretty sure she flipped me off there. Not sure what happened. This is brow power. Brow power. This is for eyebrows. <laughs> I put two and two together. That's, I put two and two together there. That's, I know what's what. It's for the eyebrows to accent them, to, to make them pop, to make sure that people notice the eyebrows, the place dividing your forehead from your eyes, to make sure that they fill in nicely. And it actually works very well, I will say that. That is, I, have, I am noticing a marked difference on this. Oh, this is amazing. It is fun to look at what she does when I'm just in the other room ignoring what she's doing with her makeup. <laughs> Wondering why it's taking 20 minutes to go to dinner. You gotta get it perfectly, yeah, you gotta get it perfect every single hair. Get them all down there, make sure it looks good. Uh -huh, looks good, it looks good to me. I have no idea what that says. Oh, it's upside down. That's why. Oh, well, that goes on the top. That goes on the eyelid. The eyelid concealer. So we can't see the top of your eye. Natural matte. Too Faced. I'm pretty sure I bought this for her. I'm going to say this was a gift. I'm probably wrong. Okay, this is, uh... This, this isn't... No, mascara goes on the eyelashes. Right? I think... I don't know. This is some sort of eye cream. It's a, it's a finish. It's a it's a matte finish that it goes around your eyes and it makes sure that your eyes pop once again. I'm gonna use that word a lot. She has pretty eyes. Just looks weird to just go around the eyeball like that. That's very it's very odd. Oh, but I, I think I definitely bought her this, the Sweet Peach uh, stuff. Oh, man. So many palettes. I know that word, palettes. Lots of palettes. That's going to go in the eye. That's going to make it sparkle. It's going to make it shine bright so that you see that part of the eye once it's closed. want to make sure that when she rolls her eyes at me, it looks great. I don't know what color that is. I'm gonna. Oh, what's this? What, what color is that? Risque. It says it's called Risque. I don't know how I feel about a video with Risque in it. All right. It seems. Oh, it's a. It's a good accent. It's a good accent point. I see that. It. Oh, it's a very good accent point. It bring. It bring. It brings your view. Brings what you're viewing to the. Oh, that's very good. Brings it all to a point. That made no sense. What I just said there. None of it. None of it is usable. And I, oh, then it goes, is that Kevin Haugen again? That's... All right, now we gotta, oh, we gotta get right in the, right in the middle. Oh, Ulta, Ulta, that's a store that I've been to. I've been there before. This is the eyeliner. I know what this is. This is the eyeliner, because it lines your eyes. That's just a pencil that you just, that looks really weird. And when you use it to accidentally write on a pa piece of paper, it doesn't work. I've tried that a couple times. Uh huh. Oh, you get it. Yeah. All right. All right. That's where your eyelashes are. Okay. The pencil helps you know where your eyelashes are. What does that say? Sexpresso. That's called Sexpresso. Right, risque and Sexpresso. I don't, I don't know how I feel about this video. Don't know how I feel about this. All right. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna put that on the rest of your eyelashes there. Oh, it looks very good. It's, it looks very good. I will say that. Right, you're doing a good job. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm good. Keep the keep. Keep up the good work. Oh, risque again. Oh, again, this video. We got to make sure that everything looks perfect. Everything is lined up. Everything just looks great. Uh huh. Now you're uh, now you're putting it around your your eye there. You're using the brush. You're, I'm, I'm gonna say you're uh, trimming. You're trimming there. I couldn't read what that was called. 
But uh, yeah, now you gotta just fill in the gaps. Fill in the gaps between the brow and the lid. Yeah, I think that's the technical term for all that. Voluminous Superstar. Oh my. I think that's mascara. I think that's mascara. I'm probably wrong. But you're definitely combing your eyes right now. Your eyelashes. It, what is going on there? What is happening? I can't... What is happening to the eyelashes there? Okay. Alright. Yo, you're making, them, uh, you're making them big. Okay, that's what's going on. Right, that's what's going on. Alright. I, I don't know what that says. That says some words. It's more... Oh! Oh, it's a lip liner. It's a lip liner. I know that term. Gotta make sure you color you color it all in. You gotta you gotta you gotta trace first, so you can color in the lines later. Yep, I've learned that. I have a child. You always trace the outline first. That way you know where to stop. You don't want to keep going. And make sure you get every little bit. The, the piece between the nose and the lip that I used to know the name of, and now it just escapes me. Oh, yep, see, coloring in, coloring in the lines. Gotta make sure you get it all in. Yep, all right. Oh, yep, lip smackers. I'm just gonna say this is called. All right, yeah, we gotta make sure that everything is there. Gotta keep the mouth open, pursed open, so that, you know, you don't actually, you don't get it on your teeth. Oh, she looks so pretty. And it matches her shirt. Oh, you hear me talking about you. Oh, that's, that's goofy. All right. I think we're done, and she's just doing a bunch of poses, which I don't have a problem with. Oh, goodbye. Have a good day.